What's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. And again, my name is Jan O'Neill, ang inyong nag-iisang ka. Opa! Before I start my vlog, I just want to say thank you so much sa lahat na nag-like, nag-subscribe, at nag-comment sa recent video ko. Maraming maraming salamat po sa suporta, sa pagmamahal, and of course, for all of your kind words guys, maraming maraming salamat. Kung bago ka sa channel ko at hindi ka pa nakasubscribe, please don't forget to click the notification bell para lagi kayong updated sa mga latest video ko. Alright, for today's vlog, it's about how to choose uh, the perfect design or templates invites for your special occasion. So, uh, for this vlog, it's about uh, invites for wedding. So, basically, uh, most of our events is wedding, pero we, we cater all kinds of events like kiddie party, debu, corporate events. Pero for today, uh, we focus tayo sa wedding. So, actually, hindi ko talaga mangolekta ng invitations after the event kasi for me ito lang yung maiiwan sa akin eh uh, bukod doon sa sign contract na pinirmahan namin ng client at ako invitation is very uh, important for me Ben actually nangungalik na talaga ako ng invitations for the past 8 years kasi for me uh, isa tong bagay na mahalaga sa amin because client is uh, the fuel of our business or the source of life of our business and for me, napaka uh, unethical naman na minsan kasi after the event makikita mo yung some copies of invitation nandun lang sa lamesa or minsan iniwan nandun sa floor para kasi parang walang iniwan niya sa picture mo, no? personal picture mo na bigla mo lang makikita sa site sa inaapakapakan for me, ayoko nang ganun so pag may nakikita ko mga invites, kinikip ko siya so it's very important na po natin gawin yun especially pag nakita ng client yun, minsan na di-disappoint sila Okay, let's start. So this is the top 9 wedding invites na na na-collect ko for 8 years sa event industry. So ito yung mga uh, napagpilian ko, nasa tingin ko uh, for my preferences na this is uh, one of the best uh, wedding invites na meron kami so far for the past 8 years na ginawa namin na event. So first, we have yung tinatawag natin na parang uh, magazine type invitation so this kinds of invitation uh, perfect to para sa mga couple na mahilig sa sa photography sa mga uh, landscape or famous landmark so it's more about uh, photos the photo details of your pictorial or your prenuptial photos so kapag ka binuksan mo siya so basically meron siyang parang uh, pouch na lalagyan na sumusuporta doon sa laman niya. So, uh, yung packaging ng invitation is like a cover magazine. And sometimes, ay nagagawa tayo ng cover details like yung parang sa mga sa mga magazine, fashion magazine. Then, pag in-open mo siya, it's uh, other details of uh, photo shoots or print na ginawa ng couple. Then, sa loob doon, makikita mo din yung mga other details na kailangan for the events. So sometimes, uh, uh, most of our client nag-hire sila ng professional uh, prenup stylist for these kinds of invitation. Uh, big factor dito yung uh, maganda yung attire mo. So it's very important, Mer meron ka different kinds of attire bawat set. So usually kasi ang prenup, meron tayong uh, 3 to 4 sets, pinaka-maximum pinaka na yung 4 kasi medyo matagal pag masyado marami damit. So, choosing the right attire for your photo shoots, it's a big factor kasi marami kang pwedeng gawin, marami kang uh, pwedeng laruin. Then, especially, of course, the emotions and gesture of client or, or, or the subject, napaka-importante yan kasi may mga client kami usually na mahihain sa first shoot, sa first set. So, it's about collaboration between the co-or, uh, the photographer, and makeup artist. So, kailangan tinutulungan natin yung client para mabos yung confidence nila once nakasalam na sila sa harapan ng lente or ng camera. Meron tayong tinatawag na parang uh, nakaklip na yung bawat pages niya. So, pag uh, in-open mo siya, makikita mo, yung, makikita mo yung bawat details or every details na kailangan mo for the events like list of entourage and then yung mop, location mop. That is the top 9 wedding invites sa ating list. So 
So we have yung tinatawag natin na parang ngayon, ito yung nauso eh. Uh, two years ago, I think, or ta, yeah, two years ago, ito yung mga nauso. I think this is a very personalized uh, kinds of invites for wedding kasi gumagamit to ng wax. So, ginagamit yung wax as a sealant for the envelope. Then, you can put any kinds of design dito sa wax stamp. Pwede yung uh, initials ng couple or ng client. So, basically, parang nagmamatch siya dun sa kailangan yung yung logo ng wax stamp is nagmamatch dun sa loob na invitation. So, usually, mga insert title. Pwede mga 3 pages lang. Pwede din na up to 4 pages or including the RSVP depende sa details. Minsan kasi yan ang papahaba dito is yung the wedding entourage. Next, we have yung tinatawag natin na parang uh, rustic style. So, usually, ito yung uh, kinds of invitations na gumagamit ng mga uh, tawag dito, mga eco-friendly materials. So, for example, the Borlan, ginagamit siya. Then, mga brown color envelope or tone materials. Then, it's very important dito yung pagkaka-print. No? So, may, meron tayong tinatawag na laser print. So, kailangan malino siya, especially kapag ganito yung paper mo, uh, brown. Usually, ayan, may name tag siya as uh, yung pinaka-lock ng envelope. Then, pag in-open mo, uh, andun din yung full details, like for every pages. This one is parang nakapasin na siya or pero siyang holder. So, iangat na lang siya sa isa. Then, yung pinaka-design niya is parang rustic style with uh, strong lights and fairy lights. So, usually, this kind of presentation, pwede din siya sa mga alfresco team. Pwede din to sa mga uh, parang uh, forest peg or fairy lights ng mga concept or pwede din to sa mga garden weddings. Usually sa mga garden wedding ko, uh, madalas ginagamit. And, and this is the top 7 wedding invites uh, style or design for me. Ito yung medyo most requested last year, last 2 years I think. Yeah. For the top 6, meron tayong tinatawag na laser cut designs for the invite. So, uh, these kinds of invites, I think this is uh, one of the uh, intricate uh, details for the invitations. Kasi yung pinaka-pattern niya, yung pinaka-design niya, machine ang gumagawa. So, i-layout ni suppliers, then yung, yung machine ang gagawa mismo ng design niya. Ito yung may mga different kinds of design na ganyan, na parang inukit siya. So, para siyang inukit na the design is a laser cut. So, usually machine po yung gumagawa nito. Then, gagawa ng pattern. Then, si machine yung magkakat when it comes to laser cut. I think, medyo pricey din siya kasi sa pagkaka uh, laser cut ng details niya. For the top six, we have the pop up or pop up invites. So I think this is one of the coolest invites, or for me, uh, super ganda nito. So actually, feeling ko wala pa masalo na gaano ng pop up for the wedding invites. Hindi ko siya masalo na encounter, but kasi this invitations uh, na nakuha ko to year 2013 pa. So, look at guys. So, pag yan siya, uh, very plain sa labas. Then, pag inopen mo siya, oh, ay, sorry, balik ko. Pag inopen mo siya, yan. So, nakita niyo to, nagpagpapap yung cobble. Yan. So, meron siyang uh, parang art or rec rec mini <laughs> Uh, mini uh, image of the couple. So, ayan. Tsaka isa pang matipid sa pages kasi uh, one pages lang. So, nandun na lahat ng 
uh, details na invitation nyo. Right? So, kung mahindi ka din sa um, cartoons or something na uh, art that will pop up or different designs, I think this is perfect, especially sa mga couple na very artistic. For the top four, we have yung tinatawag natin ng mga uh, travel team invite. So, ito naman yung mga nauso. Uh, so, nauso din to two years ago. So, meron tayong tinatawag na parang passport style. So, meron tong uh, holder supporting the passport and the boarding pass. So, meron tong boarding pass. So, and So, ang kinibahan lang ito, syempre, uh, ni-follow yung color motif ng couple or ng client. So, kaya hindi siya brown. Kasi diba, brown na nga ba ang passport niya? <laughs> Basta, ayan. Pero pwede din naman siya kung original color ng passport. And then, kung, kung iibahin mo yung color ng font style, gagawin mong gold. Uh, pwede naman yun, pero quite expensive kasi yung mga foil. Ayan. So, pag inopen mo siya, nandiyan yung details ng wedding, yung save the date, then, uh, so, yung first speech para din siya sa passport. Kaya lang, ang ginagawit dito is yung picture ng couple from Queen of. And then, pwede mo din incorporate yung other details ng photoshoot nyo. So, this wedding is uh, a Ricardo and Jamie din wedding na hinandal ko last uh, 2017, July 22, 2017. Ayan. So, uh, ito yung naging concept namin. So, meron din tayong tinatawag na, na this one is parang uh, uh, parang email or uh, letter. So, meron siyang uh, uh, post stamp sa back ng envelope. And then, sa harap, very clean lang. Pero once you open it, nakikita mo yung design ng loob niya na parang uh, globe or, yeah, globe uh, designs. Then, kapag inopen mo, and then makita mo yung bawat pages, meron siyang details sa uh, gilid na uh, for the Details like email and book, correct me if I'm wrong, yan. Yung details na yan. Then, sa second page, yung entourage list, then, gumamit sila na, uh, parang, uh, anong tawag sa ganito ngayon? Uh, oh my God, parang postcard, no? Yan. So, yung different uh, location na napuntahan ng couple. So, I think, this is a good idea din, na naisip na lectures and uh, joy. So, this wedding was last uh, 2018, August 2018. So, meron din kami dito ang uh, ginawang uh, So, basically, I'm um, playing the envelope lang when you open it. So, the color motif is uh, green, parang shades of green. Ayan. And then, pag inopen mo siya, so, meron packet sa center, and then makikita mo dito yung map ng Dubai or in geographical location ng Dubai and now uh, Philippines. So, this couple is uh, nakabase sila ngayon sa Dubai but originally from, ano sila, from Philippines. So, ginawa ko tong wedding na to is plus December 2016. So, this is the invites of Sherwin and Jane. Hi! Ayan, yung mga very close uh, friend ko na close friend ko na high school. Alright. Then, that is the top Pag-inan na tayo, one. Top 4 wedding invites design. So, ito yung, mostly ito yung mga perfect invites sa mga couple na mahiling mag-travel or yung mga couple na nakabisa abroad. So, doon nagkakilala, doon na sila hanggang they decided to get married. Top 3, we have yung packet uh, style invite sa tinatawag. So, this is one is from Sir John and Camille Wedding. So, pag inopen mo siya, a uh, plain yung envelope, then color red, yung inner uh, details na envelope. So, yung packet type uh, invite. So, basically, meron siyang parang ayan, parang folder. Then, once you open it, look, ito yung nag-hold sa other pages na yung nag-hold na packet for the other details na invitation. So, 
pwede mo siyang ganyan. So, para inserted type siya. Then, for ever pages, uh, doon makikita yung mga other details like yung RSPP, proper attire, location maps, and everything. So, ayan. So, we have also this one is uh, navy blue and silver motif color. Ayan. So, once you open it, makikita mo dyan yung uh, uh, packet uh, details na nag-hold dun sa other pages ng invites. So, this invite is from Jesse and Ernaline Wedding or Ramos and Gonzalez Wedding uh, last 2017. Ayan. My God! Tatagal, tagal na ng iba 2013. Grabe, tumatanda na ako. Alright, that is the top 3 invites. Then, for the top two, we have yung tinatawag natin na so, ito, nauso to last year. Maraming nag-retour sa akin ito. Yung tinatawag natin na Shabby Chic uh, uh, Wedding Invites or with uh, the combinations of pastel colors or creams, something nude color. So, Shabby Chic. So, usually, ayan. So, meron tayong very simple uh, envelope holder or lock holder yung tinatawag. So, gumamit sila ng or design na uh, pastel color. Then, once you open it, so, makikita niyo yung inner uh, details ng envelope sa loob. Floral pa din siya. And then, yung every pages niya, uh, ang statement talaga is floral designs. Ayan, this is from Ryan and Nico Wedding. Last uh, 2016. November 2016. Pero, look at the invitations. Bagong bago pa rin. No? Ganun po talaga ako kaingat. Then, ito, this one is from Lawrence and Mary Joy Wedding. So, basically, kapag uh, pinopin mo siya, kasi alam mo, I love the color of pastel. Ang sarap sa Malta. Especially, kapag summer, pag ganito yung color motif mo, ang lamig. Diba, nakakabawas ng init. So, ayan, kila Mary Joy and Lawrence. So, gumamit sila ng uh, parang paper. Usually, ginagamit to sa ano eh. Pwede din sa mga pastries. Pero, nagbibigay siya ng parang uh, uh, chubby cheek uh, details for the whole package of the invitation. So, pag in-open mo siya, ayan. So, ayun pa rin, for a statement, using the pastel color, creams, white, uh, so nice. Super, ano niya, limpi sa mata. This one is also is good. The uh, nude colors of pink from, I think, sorry. This is one gumamit sila ng lace this for the locks, which is nice. Lakas yung mga chubby cheek style. Then, once you open it, it ayan, floral stain it pa rin siya. So, this, na, na details sa uh, bawat pages niya. This is from Giuseppe and Angelica Wedding. Last 2018, July 2018. And also, yung envelope, yung envelope nila. Ayan, nakita mo. Floral statement pa rin siya, but uh, uh, pastel colors. And also, is a shabby cheek style invites from Nico and Abby Wedding. Ayan. Last 2016. So, sa kanila naman, uh, yung bawat pages niya is parang may uh, tawag to lock or like yung pan sa fasteners. So, parang hindi siya uh, yung malaglagi sa isa. So, may holder na siya, organizer. So, iangat mo lang siya, bawat page para makita mo yung details or yung entourage taste. Nakita nyo, they use uh, pastel colors, pinks, peach, and super cool, super salap sa mata. Uh, so for me, this is the top two wedding invites for the weddings. The chubby cheek style. And for the top one, we have the classic and elegant. So, I think this is the timeless uh, wedding invites na design. So far, ah. Kasi I love it. Super elegant eh. Super, anong tawag dito? Malakas maka royalty wedding. I like using just white and silver. They use the metallic foil uh, details for the... Uh, first name of the couple. Ayan. Super nice. Ang ganda niya. Tignan. 
very simple yet elegant. And then we have din also yung parang cream color type of uh, color of papers then gold uh, uh, designs, gold foil design for the initials of the couple. Uh, this wedding is last year lang, 2019. This one is also nice from uh, um, Mangi and Micaela wedding. So, kita nyo. So, they use uh, metallic foil for their first name or for their uh, names. Super nice. Then, pagka yan, super clean, white, then silver. Then, we have here, this is a very nice packaging from Stan and Robert Wedding. Nahandal ko siya last uh, 2018. So, kita super nice. And, I love the packaging. So, using brutes, it's not as much royalty. And then, this one, yung daman niya. They use, uh, parang, uh, parang, yung foil niya is parang gold, rose gold ba yun, the album. I love it, super nice. And the silver, uh, lining for the borders of the invitations. Ang ganda niya, super clean. This one also is really nice. So, they use stickers for their, ano, uh, stomp sa envelope. Very white lang. Diba guys? Super clean. Tingnan. Then, kapag kapin ko mo siya, look, using the these kinds of design, ang lakas makaklasik yung elegant. And then, using, ano, parang naglagay sila ng pearl details. And, kapag kinuha mo siya, yan, super white lang. And then, gold, uh, fun colors. And, Right? Super nice, diba? Super clean, super neat. Uh, elegance is timeless for me. This is what top one wedding invites for the weddings for me. It's so clean and so That is the top 9 wedding invites so far. So I hope I share a lot of knowledge to you, especially sa mga soon to be bride and groom. And so if you like this video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much everyone for watching my third video. And once again, kamsamura, sarangheyo!